All right, so let me just let the uh, soundtrack do its work there. But uh, I think I know what part of the game this is. I seem to remember the swimming section pretty clearly from LPs because it's really, really freaking bad. So I'm not quite looking forward to doing it, but this might not actually be that section yet. I think we'll find out in a bit here. So let me go ahead, dive down. There's a, uh, yeah. So he is most definitely dead. Whether or not it was Conker's fault is still up for debate, but at this point, the editing on the previous video will have been finished, so I guess we'll know what the uh, declaration was on that. So do I just swim down here? Sense. Sense. Like, wh why? Why is it not coming out pipe? Why jump down here? It, why? Okay, maybe it did come out of the pipe. No, it didn't, because it's still up there. Anyway, where's the freaking dung beetle? Isn't he supposed to, like, do something with this stuff? I guess I'll leave. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, there it is. Over there. Big ball of poop. Oh, thanks. Just, you're welcome to it, mate. Yeah. Thanks. Not sure why he doesn't just keep the mask on at all times, but yeah. So, got here a little ball of poo. Let's, uh, take it for a ride. God, this is freaking damn. So, uh, I climbed up this tower last time. I don't exactly understand the way that this thing loops around, because... I don't know. Wait, why did he go in there? Okay. I guess he just had to rest for a quarter of a second and then went back on his patrol. Alright, um... Let me... Wait. Yes. What, what did he even do? Just lightly brush up against me? Oh, are you gonna take the ball away? No, he doesn't. Okay. What is this shit? What is this shit? Okay. So... Oh, there it goes. It's like, I remember the... Maybe, maybe there's a different, uh... Let me figure this out. I think there must be like two separate spirals running up this thing. And I apparently fell back into Windy for a quarter of a second there. All right. Uh, let me see here. It looks like there's another ramp. Does this actually go up the tower or no? Yeah, it does. Okay, I think that's what you have to do. You have to lead it up that one. Because then you can dump it on top of the big sleeping guy. Yeah, this is just one of those things, I guess, you're just supposed to keep messing around until you figure it out. Luckily, I kind of remember this, but otherwise, I don't know if I would have thought of this. Because it doesn't really seem particularly obvious to me. Oh, God damn it! Just, what? just whatever. Also, I don't know what it is about these voices like, on these bugs, and it's, obviously it's the fact that they're bugs anyway, but it reminds me of something from a bug's life. Like, is there a character from that that has that type of accent? Or am I just confusing because they're bugs? I don't know. Couldn't have just used the TNT. Had to do it like this. What the hell even happened there? I'm so confused. Oh, I guess I have to go get more now. Okay. And fall damage? Yup. Oh, 
the thing was right there anyway. Never mind. So off we go again. Still not exactly sure what the best way is to deal with the beetles that fly by. I guess just wait for them to do their thing and then move on. I always feel like I should, like, if I hurry, I might... Oh, here we go. I'm gonna hurry. I'm gonna make it. Except I actually did. Okay. Speed run strategies. Strategies as in get lucky and happen to walk there at the right time. Yeah. So, I guess now we can get past big sleeping asshole and... What do we do with this ball? I have no idea. Presumably something. But I couldn't tell you what. You just go away. Come on. Like, you're not that much of a threat. You're just kind of there. a pile of money on top. Let's see, what did this thing do? Alright, I suppose I can accept that. What if I don't want another ball? What am I supposed to do with it? How do I get up there? Unless that's where you come out when you go in here. And I'm fairly sure I know what's actually in the mound, but, uh... I'm gonna try again, just in case. Can I go in here myself? Nope, invisible barrier. Oh, wait. Okay, there we go. And what, uh... Strange line, is he gonna say this time? I do like how it was muffled. Good attention to detail there. Alright, um. I actually do remember something else I can do with the ball of poo, so. Let me go tend to that before I go inside the mound here. Just, uh. Keep face planting my way my way down. It'll be fine. So let's see if I can just take this over here. God, the textures. I hope I didn't need to get this thing to a certain size. these things even supposed to be. That's a shitty way to go. Lol. Get it? It's a pun. And just in case I want another one, which I don't think I particularly do, but uh, I'm gonna see what this thing does. Every one of those fish needs to be counted. I normally wouldn't, because they didn't seem, like, sentient or anything. But just for the sake of being irritating, every single one of those fish has to be counted. No, I don't know if they actually should or not. I guess we'll see uh, where those go. Because I think down there is where the grinder is. So, yeah, they probably died. see. Yeah, what happens if I go down here? Do I die? Yeah, you do. Okay, so yeah, those fish died. They go on the counter. <clears throat> Alright, anyway, moving on. I think I know what this is. Why did you take it off? 
you going? I don't, wait, uh, take, take my advice and get out of here. It's, it's still really bad in there. You just don't want to go in there. Calm down. Now, just calm down and tell me what's the matter. Right. Okay. It all started about two days ago. It was me and the lads. We were having a cup of tea. The next thing we know, Tez is gone. Tez, uh... We couldn't find him. We thought, ah, oh, maybe he's just gone off, you know, like, do a bit of shopping or something. He never came back. Bazza was next. He was just walking along. Mind so Bazza business. went from being so I stood down and said, hey, an Bazza, how you electric going eel there? enemy from, over. like, Donkey Kong Country to a type it's of battery in Banjo-Tooie. And now it's a, uh, dumb beetle. Was it something else, too? Bazza seems to be, like, a recurring thing. I don't know. The lads are gone. The bastards have nailed me in. I'm out of here. You can do what you like. There's some money up there if you can be asked to get it. See us. See, I'm not sure what type of accent you call that. I mean, it's like... There's multiple types of British accents, so you, you can't just call it that. Some sweet corn. God damn it. Who's that? Anyone. It's like it's a mix of that mm. and like almost a New Yorker, okay. is what That's it sounds what like. It sounds very John DiMaggio ish. Um, yeah, I imagine I probably want to be far away from that hand. All right, these do not do anything yet that I am aware of. I think those are used for later things. So, yeah, let me go ahead and. Do the sweet corn stuff. Let's get away from the hand. Do I throw you in here? Throw you in the middle? Oh yeah, there's like a thing over here. So, uh, is there anybody watching who doesn't know what this part is? For the two of you who don't, I'm not going to say anything yet. Because this is probably the most well-known part of the game, but it's for a pretty good reason. It's just kind of legendary in its own way. But, uh, like I said, most, most people watching this, if you haven't played the game, you've at least heard of this section probably, but... I will remain silent for now. And instead just, uh... Mention the fact that uh, these pieces of corn here are totally not just the cheese model, but, like, very slightly edited. Dodging this hand is moderately annoying also. Alright, so that's three pieces of corn that I've killed. That's like the stupidest sounding thing ever, but hey. Um, so, you know what? Let's go ahead and do three more after I get rained upon by giant blobs of shit first, of course. And eat the uh, floating poo chocolate. What is this? <laughs> the face! No, I don't, I'm not sure what that clear barrier is. Like, is there such a thing as crystal poo? Like, I, I'm thinking there probably isn't. Oh, I thought it was stunned. Okay. And, oh, thank you very much. Oh, come on, really? God, the stock sound effects. Just the kind of things going on. Although I do have to admit the uh, the noise that the ball of poo made when you were rolling it uh, was disturbingly realistic sounding. I mean, there's plenty of other things that could be that same type of texture, but yeah, it it, it worked well for what it was made for. All right, let's. Probably get smacked by the thing again. 
no, I'm not sure what the hell that aiming was. Is he not even going for me? Oh, no. And I believe this is going to trigger a cutscene. Yep. Definitely the same as the chase. Well, here we are, folks. Me, 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 me. I am the great mighty foo, and I'm going to throw my shit at you. A huge supply of dish come from my chocolate starfish. How about some scat, you little twat? I could have tried singing along with that, but it, there's no reason to. Obviously, I wouldn't really be doing it any... Oh, wait, I don't want to do this yet. I need to wait for him to go, Oh, and then you go. So does he do that on his own, or do you have to do something else first? I'm gonna hang around for a bit because I don't remember how this fight progresses. Oh, yeah, here we go. Got it, okay. And large pile of effect fly out. Do you really think you'll survive in here? You don't seem to know which freak you're in. Sweet corn is the only thing that makes it through my rear. How do you think I keep this lovely grin? Have some more caviar. <laughs> like, I, I think it's pretty much accepted that, um, this game was a result of Rare just not giving a shit, and... Like, they were sick of doing the cutesy animal games, and they wanted to, like, because they, they've been hiding just innuendo and random other, like, immature jokes in their games for a while. So they're like, you know what, let's just get it all out in one go. Like, if it's not, if it's not been specifically said that that was the reason, it's a pretty well-accepted answer. But, uh, seriously, Rare, like, what the fuck is this game? Like, how do you even think of something like this? And who greenlit it? I just, I, I can't even imagine. Like, I mean, that, that, that's one of those things that, like, it, it's one of those really stock phrases that people with no imagination say. Like, whenever something with any amount of, like, absurdity or creativity to it is like, oh, I'd love to have seen the meeting for that. Ugh, okay, that sucks. Um, so I have to redo the whole fight? Probably. I was only one phase into it, but still. So yeah, let's go ahead and skip this. As glorious as the song is, we don't need to hear it a second time. But it's, uh, it's like I said, it, there's always that one person that is like, oh, they must have been on drugs to think of this, and it's like, or they maybe were just kind of creative and, like, think outside the box, and they're not freaking, like, boring-ass office workers, but that's for stuff like Mario, where it's like, yeah, there's, abs there's like, weird things in it, stuff that wouldn't happen in real life, but it's not opera singing poo. There, there's, a, there's a bit of a difference there. It's like you have to really, real, you have to realize someone came up with the idea and then everybody accepted it basically, and they went through countless man hours to put together this fight. But probably just based off of like some inside joke or like they were like, "Hey, what if we did this? That would be hilarious." And then they're like, "Oh, wait, let's actually do it." I don't know. I'll shut up, though. Okay, where are you gonna pop up? I 
can't tell where you are. Come on. Got him? Yep. I'm not sure if I have to get him twice in this phase or only once. Yeah, it looks like twice. Because it's Conker's Bad Fur Day, why wouldn't it have to be twice? Phase one, you do it once. Phase two, you do it twice. Phase three, you do it three times. stuff. Eh. Come on. How did that not count? Damn it all. I really suck at the aiming. Or that, or just the aiming really sucks in general, because there's not really any way to, like, tell what the hell you're doing. <laughs> did it always make that noise when it landed, or just that one time? Come on, it looked like it was going to land somewhere completely different. And the chocolate doesn't seem like it's respawning. We got it? Okay, good. So, let's get to our final verse of the song. I think. There might be one more after this. Now I'm really getting rather mad or like a niggly, tickly, shitty little pack nut. When I've knocked you out with all my bab, I'm going to take your head and ram it off my butt. Your butt. My butt. Your butt. That's right, my butt. Ugh. My butt. <laughs> my butt. So, does the giant mound of poo have its own digestive system then? Does it have its own ultra poo that it creates? Is that where this whole level came from? I mean, that would make sense. I guess. Ugh, come on. Okay, good, I got one. These phases are pretty bad, from what I remember. You don't get very much time at all to react. So I got lucky there. Also, what the hell is a tag nut? Or bab, for that matter. I mean, I can tell from the context, obviously, it's more poo, but, like, what the hell are these phrases that they're using? God damn it. Oh. You can pop up here. Yep. Okay. If I can survive one more phase, that would be lovely. Because I've only got two more hits, and... I really, really don't want to have to redo the whole fight again. Oh, shit. I like how every time I say, oh, shit, it's kind of relevant to the level. But, uh... Come on, just... Get this shit crap over with. It's like... Okay, I think we're good. Yep. Pop up here, please. I don't want to try to aim. Pop up here, please. No. Come on. Got it. Are we good? How is he layering over himself? That's not realistic at all. Okay, so now I have to continue to dodge stuff as I get to the last section. Ugh. Come on. Oh, god damn it. Oh, this is not good. I need health really badly. Either that or I just need to be very good at dodging these, which I'm usually not. Okay, here's health. Thank god. It's very hard to see. It blends in quite well. This is the right direction, I'm hoping. Is it not? I don't think it is, actually. God damn it. Um. 
Oh, wait. Let me just get the money. Yeah, there it is. Okay, I just have to pull the handle. I was I was looking for a B button. Handle, go. Where does he end up? What I call a bowel movement. Hey, what about me? All right, well. Hey, over here. Again, one of those things that the game kind of speaks for itself. Not a whole lot I can really add to that section. Spondooly. Because that's a thing, apparently. All right, so I guess there's the section that uh, he got flushed down into, and then there's the area over by the uh, whirlpool. Not sure which I'll do next, but that is going to be the end of this segment, because I think that is quite enough singing poo for now. Well, that's the rest of the singing poo for the whole game, but whatever. Shut up. Ending. Your butt. My butt. Your butt. That's right, my butt. Uh. My butt. Uh. My butt. Uh. My butt. Uh. My butt. Uh.